Hi folks, I'm Marcus Allen of StumpMarcus.com. If you capture email addresses on your website, you know a lot of your emails are not getting delivered to your recipients. Even if you suggest whitelisting ideas, most of your subscribers won't bother and wade through the confusing and endless instructions. The good news is John Saya solved the problem and created Email Whitelister. Email Whitelister is simple to use from every angle and it's 100% free. Here's how it works. As soon as your website visitors subscribe to your online lead capture form, Email Whitelister sniffs out the email address and pops open easy to understand whitelisting instructions. If you collect email addresses as leads, you're going to love this. And here's the best news. Email Whitelister is totally free. No catch and no strings attached. Email Whitelister is a cinch to install too. There's no need to hire those hard to track down, expensive programmers. Just log in at John Sayers free CGI connection and look for the Email Whitelister link. The fastest and easiest way to install Email Whitelister is to click the Auto Install link, select the default setting of installing it on your website, and finally click the Begin Submit button. Next, enter your FTP login details of your website. Those are the details sent to you usually by email when you first signed on with your web hosting company. As an example, I'm going to use my new website called truthin7minutes.com. Next, click this Submit button to launch the auto installer. John's auto installer uses your CGI bin to install email whitelister on your website. Just click on any of your CGI bin directories to complete installation. And there you go. In just seconds, everything is installed on your website automatically. Now it's time to fill in a few details to tweak email whitelister. Here is your control panel. Once you enter a password of your choice to protect your control panel from competitors, enter the email return address that you use to send out emails to your recipients. Email Whitelister uses this email address to help bypass your emails past your recipient spam filters. Next, enter your CGI connection username here. Doing so gets you paid cash via PayPal every month. Stay tuned for the details in a few moments. Now it's time to enter your website domain name here. Doing so prevents a competitor from linking to your email whitelister, using up bandwidth, and costing you higher website fees at the same time. Now, as you see, all the latest whitelisting instructions are automatically filled in for you. And anytime there's a new update, you're alerted about it and given the option to update these instructions in just a few mouse clicks. Once you click the Submit button, you're now on the one yard line. John's configuration wizard looks at your current lead capture form on your website and with your help, tweaks the form to complete installation of his email whitelister. This is the form action line of code that we're going to tweak. And finally, we need to know which part of your lead capture form is the email address. John's configuration wizard is intelligent enough to figure it out. All that's needed is for you to confirm the email section. In just seconds, you're ready to complete installation of email whitelister. As always, anytime you make changes on your website, creating a backup is strongly recommended. Now that email whitelister is configured, let's test it out. As you see, when we fill out this lead capture form, email whitelister pops up specific suggestions, giving your new subscribers detailed whitelisting instructions specific to their email provider. It's a snap to make the final changes to install Email Whitelister. To complete installation, we're going to tweak a single line of website HTML and add a new line of HTML code. Really, it's a snap, even if you're new to website design. Simply copy this HTML code, open your web page, find the current HTML code, and replace it with the new HTML code. See that? It's pretty simple, isn't it?
finally return back to the email whitelister and look for this JavaScript code. We're going to copy it to memory and paste it between the closing body tag and the closing HTML tag. The last step is to save your web page and now email whitelister is working flawlessly on your website. Now if that wasn't easy enough for you, John includes a super easy way to finish your installation of Email Whitelister. On the same configuration page, there's an option to download converted web page and save. When you click on this link, the newly tweaked web page is downloaded to your computer hard drive. Just locate this file, change the file name, and upload it to your web host via your FTP software.